Welcome back, y'all. Today we're gonna be looking at uh, Alien Man, a real head figure. Real head, not dead. R H N D, real X head, however you want to say it. Real head, my favorite artist. Y'all already know, so I'm not gonna talk too much about old Morrison there, the man, the myth, the legend. But uh, yep, this is one of the re releases from 2019. There's many, many, many different colorways of this guy. Um, I like the little little touch more he does with these little handkerchiefs, little scarves that he does with a little cloth. Super nice little touch. Um, this guy is cool. I like how his his helmet here is a uh, it's like a clear. It's clear, and then this side of the helmet is all black, like super nice. Bam! Super shiny. The gloves are also little spaceman gloves. They're also clear. The match the back of the head, that gray clear vinyl. Um, these do come off. You can put different arms and stuff on them, but I never, I never mess with stuff like that. I leave them how they come. If it comes with like an additional piece, I'll display it next to it on my own shelf. But other than that, I don't mess with it. I like to keep it how Maury has it. Plus, I, Maury's banned people from a shop for life. For like painting over toys that he's made or like putting different stuff on them. He does not like that shit. So word of advice, don't alter anything. I don't know why you'd want to, but some people are like, oh, I'll just have somebody else paint it. Don't do that shit. You'll get your, you'll get, uh, uh, he'll ban you for life. There's people on Instagram selling like knockoff shit. Like one of them's, uh, I think it's called like fuck your mother. On Instagram, they do like knockoff shit, and people will buy them for super cheap and then pay someone to paint them. Maury knows the difference, so don't even try it. I know somebody happened. He was, I was, we were trying to figure out how he had so many new toys, and it turned out that's what he was doing. He was buying from that guy, having other people paint them. Maury can tell the distance like that. Bam, block from his from his Instagram. He'll never be able to go to Maury's shop ever again. Not worth it. But here it is, super nice detail. So I got the brown right there. You got some nice silver in there, some silver, a little silver spot on the on the uh, the belt there. You got the the lightning going all down the legs. Now the body, Mori came out with this body, and I believe it was 2014. Um, as far as Alien Man himself, I'm not sure exactly when the first Alien Man came out. But I made it a mission of mine to get me one of these. And as soon as I, I seen it, I had to have it. Mora usually has like two to three options. If you get to go to his store and win the lottery, he usually has like two or three options you can choose from. Um, but this one was... I mean, I have a hard time picking no matter what when I'm there. Because you got three real head figures in front of you. And you only have a little bit of time to decide. Like I start, I start sweating and shit. Like I, I can't make up my mind. I want all of them. I want everything. I can't just pick one. It's literally the hardest thing ever. And plus, I'm already overwhelmed because he has so many cool toys. Like we walk in, it's like dark in there, but he's got oh, he's got like art pieces here, boxes of toys there, uh, toys that are hidden behind little curtains, and he's got a shelf displayed with just a shit ton of toys. I asked Maury son. Uh, I asked him what his favorite toy was, and he said all of them. So I'm sure he, yeah, I think he tries to keep like one of each release. So I'm sure in, at his house or wherever his secret workshop is where he like paints these, I'm sure it's just stacked with like one, one of, you know, how, one of 30 of every single piece he had. He probably makes 31 pieces of each, and then one of them he keeps, and the other 30 he sells in this store. But, uh, yeah, anyways, kind of just talking rambling here. Here it is, Alien Man. Catch you all next time.